I just want to quickly mention while I'm editing this, I realized I have enough footage for three videos. So this is going to be a three-part series back to school shopping in Japan. We're going to four different stores. I hope you enjoy. Stay tuned. Aloha, it's Katie and I'm back in Japan to shop from back to school. I was just looking at their stationary items and I've seen already a couple of new really cool items. So get ready to go back to school shopping with me in stationary heaven art. Who stay to the end because I am hosting a giveaway. So one of you lucky viewers will be winning some of these back to school items that I shop for. Giveaways international, you have nothing to lose. So let's go back to school shopping. So right now I'm at Big Camera, which is more an electronic store actually, but almost every department store here has a stationery section. It's not big in Japan, so I'll show you that. But if you're new to my channel, welcome to our Alohana, which is what we call our family of subscribers. We are so crazy close to 100,000 subscribers. You should join our family below. And also subscribe to my blog channel. Check out my other back to school videos by clicking the top right eye because it's just in Hong Kong and the Philippines, so you can get a variety of stationery items around the world or Asia in particular. I also get free shoutouts every video, like these little for people on. Screen. If you want to be up here too, just subscribe to the channel and my blog channel. Turn on notifications on, then comment aloha for the message you want to share with our family subscribers. So there's a radio directly above me. I hope you can hear me. But you guys know I'm talking a lot about standing pencil cases and it's getting a bit old, you know. But this I just saw is amazing. It's a double decker standing pencil case. And that's the image, and I'll show you right now how it works. You open it. What do you do with this? The heavier part, you pull back. And there's a magnet here that makes it click. You can hear it. You can mind blowing guys. They have this protector here so you can put your pens in this slot and then here you can put your iPhone. That's what the image says anyway. So you can put your iPhone here, you can put your erasers here. There are three compartments. You guys are gonna get one of these. There are three colors. The one I showed you plus these two colors. I'm gonna get to the pastel purple one. I also just found this one. It seems to be another variation of a standing pencil case, but it's like a lunch box. If I open it, pencil holes here where you can put your pens in and it's like the image. It's actually so cool. I've never seen these kinds of pencil cases in stationery stores before. Always come to laugh, but now I'm seriously considering exploring more stationery stores in this vlog. Another cool thing I found, there are two kinds. One is called a book band pen case. It's like this, and from the image, if you look at the back, there is a pencil case that you can attach to your notebooks. That's just so convenient because that means that when you're carrying your book, you're also going to carry this pencil case that's attached to it because I love yellow and I've never seen anything like it before. I'm also going to get to this pastel yellow book band pencil case. Impulsively, I also got you guys these gel ink rollerball pens because the colors look really nice. I used to have a scissor obsession. I would get this mini portable one. I think my dad had this and then I would get this one where you keep it in that case and then you see here when you pop the scissor out it automatically pops up into this cutting position and then you put it back in the container to seal it. It's really cool but it's not super strong with cutting things but this pen cut mini I'm giving away in my back to school shopping in the Hong Kong vlog. Giveaway's gonna end July 30 so if you're watching before then you should go enter that giveaway too. I don't know if this is a big thing for you guys but I know the first time I came to Japan maybe two or three years ago these things were huge. Stapleless staples. I don't think you should use these if you're stapling a huge stack of papers, but it is very good if you're stapling like five, ten pages. It saves you the hassle of having to get stapler bullets. I think it just uses a pressure or denting system where it leaves like an intricate print, like Winnie the Pooh dress. And then. <laughs> but yeah, at least a really, I think, intricate pattern so that it's hard to separate. It gives you the image over here of what the pattern is at the back. I have one too, but I haven't used it that much. These are so cute. Um, magnet clips in animal form. Some more traditional stationery for crafting envelopes. Invitations. Old school meets new school pencil cases. This is so kind of extra, but this is an eraser shaving cleaner. On the back here, you can see if you wipe it across your notebook paper or whatever, it'll clean all the erasers and just give you really clean notes. I've also talked about Kurutoga pencils before, which is supposed to give you a lot of precision when you're writing. But another popular brand is Dr. Grip or Uni Axe Gel. They are known for their jelly pencils. It's a bit bad because in class you get super distracted and it's almost like the squishy obsession where you're just pressing on your pen the whole time and not paying attention to class, which is just so satisfying. This is also another version of this 
classic standing pencil case but in really cute animal form the final shape looks like that all you have to do is you pop this part open so that your pens and pencils can pop up of the pencil case too I've been late on this trend but there are a lot of book band pencil cases I guess people really like just attaching it clipping it on their notebooks nowadays I'm back at the hotel I'm so excited now to tell you about the giveaway one of you lucky winners will be winning all of these items so the first thing you guys will be winning is this pink hedgehog it was so pretty you even get notepads that you can cut out inside with animal prints and here on the back it even comes with these animal cutouts get crafty and cute it's also for 2019 so you will have the whole year complete the next two things I can decide and they have so many cool pencil cases that you probably don't have where you are unless you're in Japan then lucky you two of these pencil cases one is the Masta pen case in lavender and blue I really like pastel can you tell it's amazing the second one after I was able to understand is this book band pencil case in pastel yellow I think it's magnetic so it attaches to your notebook I went a bit crazy on the the items for you guys a bit of everything the first were these five color pens from the back it said they are gel ink rollerball water-based pigment slash waterproof pens again really pretty bright colors then I got you the famous Kurotoga pencil in this really sharp and electric blue color I've used these before I love them and I hope you do too another pen I got was a tri-color ball pen which comes with black red blue and a pencil which is the handle that can also be clicked down on and acts as a mechanical pencil I actually ended up getting you two highlighters and I forgot I did but they're two different kinds of colors so this one is in really really bright neon colors and it's a pencil style I think it'll also give you more control and it'll leave a stronger pigment or stronger color whereas these mod liner ones are iconic Japanese highlighters that I think everyone has seen may not be able to get them so I got you guys these mild liner pastel highlighters they're so soft you just get two varieties something also cool I found was this pencil eraser shaped like a pencil has a white tip but it's actually an eraser it's pretty deceiving but it's also like that is cool the last thing I got was this XS white stapler I have something just like it and it is so convenient you know what? I'm gonna try to show it to you guys right now this is the stapler basically right now you can't staple it because it's in this nice compact shape but what you do if you want to unlock it is you open it here then at the top there is a lock so what you do is you push it down and you hear that click then the next time you try to close it it's already in the form of a stapler then if you want to unlock it you just push it up close it back again the refills are also the same you just put them up here those are all the giveaway prizes the angle changed a bit but now for the giveaway rules if you want to win these items just follow all of these steps first subscribe to this channel Katie Tracy and my second channel daily Katie which is my blog channel second follow me on Instagram and Twitter at Aloha Katie X finally like this video and comment down below what item you are looking forward to winning the most and a contact method so I can contact you if you win this can be your Instagram Twitter email just a way for me to reach out if you you win because this is a bit of a bigger giveaway and it is going to be my back to school giveaway i do have some extra entries just one to make things easier if you want a better chance at winning then after following those rules you can get an extra entry by doing four of the following repost that photo on instagram and hashtag it to aloha katie x and katie's bts giveaway then also retweet my giveaway tweet on twitter which i will link down below also add me on snapchat at aloha katie x and add me on google plus the social media package so if you want to increase your chances at winning then and just follow all the previous steps and comment an additional comment saying you did the social media package including all four of those the giveaway is international so anyone around the world can enter make sure your parents know because when you win I'll be asking for your shipping address so be ready to give me that don't forget I do a lot of giveaways so don't worry if you don't win I also have a Hong Kong one going on right now so you should also enter that I got some stationary items in Hong Kong after I did a back-to-school shopping vlog there too the giveaway will also end July 30 11 59 p.m. PST so I highly suggest you enter those two that's all for this back to school shopping vlog give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it subscribe down below you can scan my snapchat on your right and follow me on social media at lola kitty x click the top right eye to watch more of my videos i do a lot of back to school and college videos i have new videos every weekend a lot more exciting things are in store love you so much bye guys